When an alert is triggered in any of your security tools, it is quite important to keep track of these triggered alerts to help you identify potential signs of misconfigurations, attacks, or what was done to that particular alert. But how does one begin tracking these alerts? This is where a ticketing system can come into play. Welcome to day 23 of the 30 day My D for SOC Analyst Challenge, which is a challenge that I created for the sole purpose of helping aspiring SOC analysts obtain practical experience in 30 days. If you're interested in following along with this challenge, I would highly recommend that you do pause this video and start from day one if you haven't done so already. In this video, I'll go over what a ticketing system is and introduce you to one that you can spin up on your own for free. So what is a ticketing system? Well, it's exactly what it sounds like. A system that can create tickets and these tickets can include anything you really want. For example, a ticket can be an alert, a customer complaint, a troubleshooting request, or any request for that matter. The objective here is to keep track of the task at hand and to have a way to provide both an audit trail and accountability, which if you were to go back to your basics and security, by having a ticketing system, it would satisfy one of the A's in the AAA, which again is authentication, authorization, and accounting slash auditing. Ticketing systems can be pretty much anything really, but there are some popular softwares out there that you'll see in the real world environment, such as Jira, ServiceNow, Freshdesk, and Zendesk. And all of these are all commercial products, but the objectives remain the same. One ticketing system that I want to introduce you is an open source ticketing system called OS Ticket, which is a product of Enhance Soft. Looking at OS Ticket's site, they have a bunch of features that will fulfill some of the core responsibilities in the other commercial products that I mentioned previously. OS Ticket has the ability to customize fields, create ticket filters for routing purposes, assign and transfer tickets, and the option to set an SLA, service level agreement. By integrating OS Ticket into your tech stack, you can now start to mimic a small SOC startup, which is pretty exciting. I mean, hey, this challenge is all about helping you get practical experience. OS Ticket does allow you to either self-host it, aka on-prem, or have them manage it for you for a fee. And depending on what choice you choose, there are some operational benefits for you. However, with the free self-hosted version, you can only get email integrations and nothing else. But that is perfectly fine and enough for this 30 day challenge. Now that you know a little bit more about what a ticketing system is and what OS Ticket has to offer, hopefully you're as excited as I am to get started on spinning this up and integrating it. In the next video, I'll walk you through on how you can begin setting up and configuring OS Ticket so you can get started with this ticketing system. As a reminder, I will be doing a giveaway where one lucky winner will win a free voucher for the My D for SOC Analyst course. And additionally, there will be three one month passes for Try Hack Me up for grabs. Details are provided in the description down below. If you're an aspiring SOC analyst, I would highly recommend that you participate to level up your practical skills. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe if you want to. Remember to stay curious and do things differently.